Preserving Witlands. Okay, I'm doing a science project about save, preserving our witlands, and our purpose is the wetland is like a filter that blocks out our dirt and soil from getting into the clean water, and which is that is helping our environment. And our hypothesis is when the sponge is there, not a lot of dirt will get get in the um, lake. But when all, when, but when the sponge wasn't there, all uh, the dirt just got in into the um, lake. These are our materials. We need one full roasting pan, two large sponges, one spray bottle or watering can, sharp knife to cut sponge, clay enough to cover half of the pan, and the potting soil. Our procedure is first we made a slow peel out of clay and curved it down to make it a hill for the land. And then we had put the sponges next to the land and had and had poured the water down and poured the water down and it was like a little dirt to get in there. But lastly we had did it without the sponge, but when we poured the water, all the dirt got into it. So you can see that now that our results are that with the wetlands that there's not much trash and dirt. But without the wetlands that is like all the water will get dirty. And our conclusion was this is why we need um wetlands in our um on our earth and communities. This is what we learned. The importance of a wetland is the filter because the filter blocks all the dirt and soil from getting into the clean water. And in our project, the filter was the sponge because it absorbed the dirt and, and soil from getting in. And the wetlands are help from stopping floods because it absorbs the rain. So the rain won't get high and make a big, a big flood. But wetlands are just a help to stop causing floods.